Hey guys, Rick from Sonus here, back in our video. In this video, we're gonna begin with the start to finish series. So I put a poll on my YouTube asking which genre I should make. So it came out to be a draw between Bass House and Deep House. But because the weather is quite good today, I'm really feeling Deep House. So let's go with that genre. So in this part, we're gonna make a breakdown. Second part, we're gonna work on the build up. And the last part, I think we're gonna make a drop. It's gonna be a weekly series. So stay tuned for that. Now let's get it started. First we're gonna find the focal on Splice. So let's head over to Splice. Go to Sounds. Quite often I get a question, how do I find my focals on Splice? So basically what I do is I keep an eye on the new packs on Splice because I do hip hop productions as well. So that's quite sample based. So I check Splice like two or three times a week, digging into the new packs, finding cool stuff. So let's do that right now as well. Let's see if there's any new focal packs. This one looks like a focal pack. It is a focal pack for pop, R&B and electronic music. So let's check the samples. So I'ma light it up just like a cigarette smoke till it's in my head, take it all away. This one sounds quite cool yeah, actually. I'm gonna light it up just Let's download it. Maybe we're gonna use that one. I really like it, so... Let's check for some other sounds. They started fires, I'm seeing red. They keep dropping bombs, but they're not gonna win. No, 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 no. I don't need no... I do like that one, but I don't like the no, no, no part, so... Let's not go with that one. Sun is out and feeling low. High on happy over the... Well, let's try to see what we can make with the first vocal. So let's load it in NFL. I think we're gonna go for around 125 BPM. I have no clue yet what we're gonna make, but hopefully it will turn out cool. Fit it to the tempo. Set 135 BPM. So I'ma light it up just so I'ma light it Focal up sound just this. like a cigarette. We're gonna make it more deep houses by lower down the way. I think it could use some more reverb and delay. So let's add the, so let's add the delay. We're gonna EQ it as well. Just dip it around the mid lows. Not sure whether or not I like this part of the vocal, but maybe we can use that for the pre-chorus. First, we're gonna make the breakdown, so we're gonna write some chords. Let's select the Serum preset. So I'm gonna look for a Reese bass. Like this one. So I normally write my chord progressions with a keyboard. Just really simple stuff. I really can't play keyboard, but it's just easier to listen to the progressions. So let's write on the focal. So I'm gonna light it up just like a so I'm gonna light it. So I'm gonna light it up just like a cigarette smoke. So I'm gonna light it up. Actually, the presets could use some more harmonics. <laughs> this preset sounds quite cool. We're gonna use that one. So we're gonna start with the F because it's in key. So I'm gonna light it up. So I'm gonna light it up just like a cigarette. So I'm gonna light it up just like a cigarette smoke till it. So I'm gonna light it up just like a cigarette smoke. So I'm gonna light it up just like a 
I think I'm gonna go for uh, this progression with the first part. So we're gonna play it in. Just like this. We're gonna edit on the we're gonna edit on the grid. Sounding like this. Now we need something for the second part. So I think we're gonna use variation of it. So the first part. That sounds quite cool actually. Let's try it. So we're gonna instead we're gonna start so instead we're gonna start off at A at A sharp going to C sharp and ending on a uh, ending on the F. So, so, so. Sounding like this with a focal. So, Focal is pitching quite weird, so we're gonna do so we're gonna throw it back to G minor. That's cool, but we're gonna use another re preset for it. A bit more heavy sound. I think it's in the future selection two pack. Sounding like this. So I'm gonna light it up just like a cigar. That's much better right now. Let's layer it. I think I'm gonna use a preset for the lit sound spec. Because I really like this preset on top of the Reese bases. Yeah, that's cool. So I'm gonna light it up just like a cigarette smoke till it's in my head, take it all away. So now we're gonna add a piano to it. So just copy off the chords. So I'm just quickly gonna shift it to A minor because because I can write chords in that key uh, way faster than in G minor, so it's quite a shame, but it is what it is. Let's shift it back to G minor. Then we're gonna strum it with Alt S. Just to humanize it a little bit more. I'm gonna use Alt R to humanize it some more to randomize the velocity. Sounding like this. Now we're gonna process the piano. Just roll off some highs to make it a bit darker. Also cut off some lows to make room for the bass line. Sounding like this. 
let's make a separate pattern for the top sound of the reeds. So now we need to add some drums and downlifters to the breakdown. But before we're gonna add the drums, I think we need to add an, add an ARP sound to it. So let's add another serum. Just use a plug from Lit Sounds Pack. I do like this plug, so let's see how it will sound. So we're going to copy over the piano sounds. And we're going to use the tools and appreciate it. Sounding like this. Just remove the small notes. This one sounds actually quite cool. Let's add it to a separate pattern and see how it will sound with a vocal. So I'ma light it up just like a cigarette smoke till it's in my head. Take it all away. The mix is right now all over the place, yeah, but. But well, we're gonna mix it after we have done the drums, so we're gonna do that first. We're gonna use some drums from the Dirty Pack Tech. <laughs> we're gonna use some drums from the Dirty Tech Pack. So just some uh, simple drums, open eyes, claps. You know the draw. Okay, cool. We're gonna add a clap here as well. It's already the same tempo, so that's cool. We'll be adding a close hi hat as well, so. We're gonna use this one. And we're gonna add it right before the second hi-hat, I think. Let's see how that sounds. Yeah, that's cool. So I think this will be the first room pattern. Nothing too crazy. Yeah, that's cool. So for the second breakdown, I guess we're gonna we're gonna add a kick to it. So now we need to fill it up with some effects, some downlifters, risers, that kind of stuff. Let's add this crowd loop first. Because that kind of stuff really fills up your track. So I'ma light it up. Just regarding this snare build as well, because we're gonna use that from the for the pre for the build up. So Let's add some final sounds to it as well. So Let's add some so normally I use this finial sound. It gets some more warmth to the track. It's a bit too loud right now, so drag it down. 
Man, some bird attack. Sound in this. Then we're gonna add a string sound to it. Let me quickly find a sample. So I normally use this string sound. Fit it to the tempo at 126. And pitch it up one semitone. Cut it. Sounding like this. So now we're gonna add effects the downlifters. So first some crashes. The reverse of the crash. Let's quickly mix it. I got these mixer channels saved. So it really saves a lot of time. You just select the crash. And there you have your processing on it. It really speeds up your workflows. I use it all the time. Now let's search for some more downlifters. Just on simple ones. Lower down the foil quite a lot. And I want to go for the Casper Riser because yeah, that's way too overused. I think we need some transition sweeps and some white noise. So let's search for it on splice. Fit it to the tempo. And put it in the background. Let's use this one. Sounding like this. Now the only thing we need to do is mix it a little bit more. So now let's mix it some more. Starting off with the drums, first clap, with the second clap. We could get rid of some low ends. Lower down 60 beats as well to get some headroom. We're gonna add some reverb to the second clap to let it fade out a bit more. So we're gonna use the Valhalla room. The Valhalla room. Bit too loud right now. Sounding, I guess. Then at the hi hats.
I'm gonna lower down the volume of the hi hats a little bit more. Because we're gonna open it up at the drum bus. Just properly EQ it. Then add a close hi hat. We're gonna pan it. Then we're, gonna run, then we're gonna route them out to the drum bus. We're gonna mix the track saves for that as well. It's called drum bus for house music. So just some soft clipping, transient processor. Add some more transient to it. And some parallel compression. Then the last thing we're gonna add is the Neutron. It's a transient shaper as well, but we're only gonna add it to the high end of the sounds. To 5k and up. So this will really make the drums pump a little bit more. So without... And with it... That's for drums, so... Now we're gonna mix the reese bass first. So now let's mix the reese bass. Mixing wise is nothing too crazy. It's just about getting the levels right, so... Just one here, and then, then we're gonna we'll the focal it back in. Just like it. Then we're gonna just stop it up to the bass. Just make sure to cut off the lows to make room for the reese bass. So that's it for the processing. Now we're gonna mix it in. Just mix it a little bit to the back. Open up the stereo separation a little bit. Makes it a little bit wider. Now we're gonna add a piano back in. That does need some processing, some compression, some OTT. Just, I guess, and some reverb and delay. We're gonna use some quarter delay. Nothing too crazy. And some fab photo reverb. Then open up a stereo separation again. And mix it in. Just like it. Does need some more queuing. So it's like a high cut and low cut. Just like it. Now we're gonna mix in the arc. Just EQ it. We're adding a high shelf to it. And we're gonna mix this. And some stereo imaging as well. Just to really mix it to the size of the stereo field. And we're gonna add some reverb. Just like it. Now we're gonna add a clap fill back in. Just gotta left with right. Same for the other effects. Just like a cigarette smoke till it's 
Burst sounds a little bit too loud right now. And let's turn back in. Press could be a little bit louder. Like that. Now we're gonna add a whole mix of track for the epic. Just to get rid of the low end. This one's, little, this, this one's a little bit too loud. Sounds already better. I think we have, I think we mixed all the elements, so that's a that's the breakdown altogether. It will sound like this. And that's it for the first part of the start to finish series. So in the next part we'll be making the build up and the part after that we're gonna do the drop. So stay tuned for that. Hit the, hit the subscribe button to stay notified. Like the video if you like the video. And I'll see you in the next one.